World of Dentistry. Dental solutions for your dental needs. Taurus Palatinus. Hello everyone. Today we will be talking about Taurus Palatinus, an oral anomaly that many people are unaware of. What is Taurus Palatinus? It is a bony protrusion that is found on the roof of the mouth, in the middle of the hard palate. These protrusions are more common in women and in people of Asian, European, and West African descent. Although they can vary in size and shape, they are not usually a cause for concern for most people. Most people with Taurus palatinus do not experience any symptoms and usually discover the protrusion incidentally during a routine medical examination. However, in some cases, these protrusions can cause difficulties in adjusting orthodontic devices, dentures, or mouth guards. They can also cause problems with swallowing or speaking if they are very large. The exact cause of torus palatinus is not known, but it has been linked to genetic factors, age, disorders in bone metabolism, temporomandibular joint disorders, and the use of certain medications. In most cases, no treatment is required for torus palatinus, but in severe cases, surgery may be necessary. How is torus palatinus diagnosed and treated? The diagnosis of torus palatinus is made through a clinical evaluation by a dentist or oral surgeon. In some cases, imaging tests such as x-rays or CT scans may be requested to confirm the diagnosis or evaluate the size and location of the torus. In most cases, it is not necessary to treat torus palatinus, as it does not usually cause symptoms or serious complications. However, in those cases where the torus affects oral function or oral hygiene, surgical removal may be considered. This surgery is performed under local anesthesia and involves removing the excess bone through a small incision in the gum covering the torus. After surgery, there may be some pain or swelling in the treated area, but this usually resolves in a few days. It is important to note that although surgical removal of the torus can resolve the complications associated with this condition, it does not guarantee that it will not grow back in the future. In summary, Taurus palatinus is a benign bony protrusion found on the roof of the mouth that is not usually a cause for concern for most people. Although it can cause some symptoms or complications in some cases, most tori do not require treatment and can be regularly monitored by a dental professional. If you experience any symptoms or are concerned about a protrusion in your mouth, it is important to consult a dentist or specialist for proper diagnosis and treatment. That's all for today. We hope this video has been useful to better understand the today's topic. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more information.